Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to video four. What is the is timer pause node? We're going to go ahead and cover the is timer paused by handle node. Now there are two is timer pause nodes. One is by function, one is by handle. We will not be covering the function version. This one is a little more finicky to work with as it requires the exact function name. Epic has added in the timer handles from both of these set timer nodes, and that is what they recommend you use. It keeps things cleaner and you can keep track of your timers better. So the is timer paused handle node basically takes in a handle and returns back a boolean of if it's true or false, it's a boolean, and if the timer is paused. And that's it. So if we run our example and I run my timer, every two seconds my number is going to go up. We can think of it as a passive regeneration on a player. Now if I hit the stop button, it's going to tell us after it pauses it, if it's paused, and then when I unpause it, if it's paused. Now if you notice, every time I hit the button, it tells me false. Well, keep in mind, I did say it needs a handle. Let's make sure we plug in the handle. Always keep in mind, if something just simply doesn't work like you expect it, make sure everything's actually plugged in. It's a really simple mistake to forget the simple things. So now that we have our timer handle, our timer handle is coming from our set timer by function. We are setting it to a variable called timer handle after we start up our function. Let's change this to one second to make our timer go quicker. And now we're going to check and see if it's actually paused after we pause it and after we unpause it. Go ahead and hit play and we'll start it up. And now we have a health regeneration. We hit stop, true, we are now paused, and if you notice, nothing is happening. We hit stop again, false, and you'll notice we are now unpaused and we're continuing. And we could, of course, do that forever. So, that's it. That is what our is timer paused by handle node does. It takes in our current timer handle, passes back if it's paused or not. If this is an invalid timer handle, it's going to go ahead and return back false. So just keep that in mind. 